Hi, grade nines. Um, I'm going to just quickly go through how to do this assignment here. So you have this worksheet here. So you are going to be using a coin to make babies. Um, so the first part of here is you have to determine the gender of the baby. Um, so we know that XY is, um, well, it tells you here, um, oh, from the mother. So if you flip ahead, give the baby an X chromosome. So I'm going to go X. Now, if you flip... Now, next one, this is the father one. Oh, it's a tails. So tails, I give them another X. So if it's double X here, this is going to be a baby girl. So we are going to have a baby girl for my baby. Your baby might be different. Um, next, you're gonna go, you're gonna go through all the different traits here. Now, these are all the different traits that we're gonna be looking at. And these are the alleles. So heads or tails. So heads is going to be, um, the dominant trait, so that's going to be our capital letter. Tails is going to be the recessive trait, which means that's our little letter there. So if I go first trait, oh, I get a tails. So tails is going to be recessive. And then I'm going to do it one more time because we have to do it twice for each trait. Now I have a heads which is a capital letter. So I've got capital and a lowercase. So the phenotype for that baby, let's go now, this is face shape. So it's got a dominant trait and a recessive. So it's got two alleles, one dominant, one re recessive. So that means that the dominant trait's going to win here because when, it's, when I have one of each like that, the dominant trait wins. So I have to go and look on this sheet here, face shape. So the dominant trait, the dominant phenotype is round. If I had had two little R's there, I would have had a square face, but I need a round face. So then, so sorry. So I go here, phenotype of the baby, round. And then I go through and I do this for all the traits, okay? So I'm gonna do one more for you. So now we're gonna go with chin size. So I have to spin it, um, roll the, uh, I guess it's flip a coin, that's what I'm looking for, twice, so I got heads the first one, so heads is gonna be dominant. Now for the second one, I got tails. Uh, you know, I'm gonna, I'm gonna pretend I got a heads on that too, just to show you. So heads, this would be dominant, dominant. So two dominant traits, that's the genotype. So now I wanna look, what's the phenotype? Remember, phenotype is what they look like. So chin size, it's gonna be the dominant trait again, because it's dominant, dominant, is large. So they've got a large chin. So I'm gonna write large. And then I go through for all of these and I finish off the baby. Now, once I'm done the baby, I can sketch my baby. So I had a round face with a big chin <laughs> and, and we're gonna go through and finish off the rest of the traits. Now, so you do this for baby number one, you do this for baby number two, and then you draw the pictures and you have what all the different traits are here. Um, any questions, you can message me, but hopefully this video will help clear things up for you. Thanks guys.